get your popcorn ready. It's about to be a show. It's actually pretty good popcorn. What is up, YouTube fam? I am Dom Moscarello, better known as Sneaker Kingdom. So for those just joining, make sure to subscribe, like, comment. As Mr. Fomer Simpson says, feed the algorithm. So today we're going to be doing a light unboxing video. Nothing crazy, just something to get the page. Without further ado, we're going to be unboxing the Jordan 3 Muslim, Muslim. For those in the comments, I'm probably pronouncing that wrong, so just correct me over there. But this is the first time I'm going to be seeing these, so here's my honest opinion. Now, for those that know sneakers, you might know that's a Jordan 3 box right there. Packaging. These are going to be off-white. Oh. Now, let's check them out. Now, this is my honest opinion. I have not seen these yet in person. Now, before I do check these out, my first opinion on these, when I saw pictures of these, I did not like them at all. Literally at all. As time went on, I started to see more pictures. They grew on me a little bit. I still didn't really like them. I am a big fan of threes, but at the same time, I did not like this colorway. So, let's check these out. Three, two, one. And honestly, I, I, I really do not like these. Um, the colorway is just weird. I mean, there really isn't colorways like this. I do not like the gray with the off-white going on here. Um, obviously I love red shoes. The majority of my sneakers I have out of my 27 pairs have red in it. Uh, I do like red sneakers. I just do not like this colorway. Otherwise, the material's kind of crazy. You're going to be able to customize these. For anyone who's into like customizing sneakers, this right here is a canvas. Um, that's going to be easy to paint, anything like that. I don't get into customizing. I did meet Marco at SneakerCon. His content's crazy. Uh, I, I would want to work with him to kind of get like a sneaker done with him, but otherwise I'm not big in a customization. Um, overall, again, I do like Jordan 3s. Jordan 3s are one of my favorite models, but again, I wouldn't be able to rock this colorway. Um, again, for a shoe that has a colorway that it's, that's, that's hard to match, I mean, unless you have like an off-white, unless you have a gray, like I'm probably going to rock like an all-black outfit with these. That would that would be the easiest match, but otherwise, like black and red, black and gray, like I really don't like these personally. Um, based on rating these, um, it's kind of based off of what I already have. So I have three threes right now. I have the Amamani Air threes, I've got the Fragment threes, and I've got the Fire Red threes. And honestly, all three. Are better than this sneaker right here. I'll I'll grab all of them, kind of do a side by side comparison here. So obviously the Amam on year three is gonna be way better than this, but we're gonna start with that anyway. So again, quality on these are insane. That's one of the biggest things about the Amam on year threes. But otherwise, colorways, these are just way better. I mean, again, this is a hard match on the Amam on year three, but it's so subtle, like. Again, it's mainly white, gray, and then that's that's similar to that there. But again, not a fan. These these take the cake. These are one of the these top three shoe of the year last year. Fragment three is we're gonna move on to. Again, this is the shoe I probably wear most now. This is one of my favorite sneakers outright. I hated this shoe at first. That's the funny part. I hated this shoe because of the back. Literally the yellowing, like I did not like these at all because strictly that. Um, otherwise, this is one of my favorite shoes now. Again, black and white is way better than this. Uh, now we're gonna move on to one of my least hyped threes, the Fire Red threes. Honestly, these have a lot of hate and I do not know why. Uh, price started going up on them. Uh, price is probably around like 250 now and honestly, they should keep going up. So, Fire Red Jordan 3s. Obviously, like these a lot better than these as well. I just do not like these personally. I'm going to be honest. Um, I wish I did have the Chicago exclusive, uh, but I do not. Um, again, I like red shoes. There's slight red hints here, but again, just not it. Um, 
Now let's talk about resell on these a little bit. I'm surprised on the resell on these. Um, we're gonna check out some StockX prices here. All right, so again, my size is a size 10. And these retail for around $200, I wanna say. Yeah, I think $200. Um, they're reselling right now for 261 in my size. Um, after that, prices are surprisingly high on these. Like you go to a size 12 and it's 284. Um, 11 and a half, 265, 12 and a half, 288, 13's 269, 14's 295. You go to the smaller sizes, we got a size 7, 299, 7 and a half, 270. These, these are dipping in the lower sizes, which used to be the money sizes, but again, like size 9 men's, 261, size 8, 255. These, these are the lower sizes and these are going for, for a lot less, about like 20 to $30 less. But uh, overall, I really personally hate the colorway on this. The materials are insane. I'll be honest. The materials are insane. If they put a different colorway on this with these materials, I would probably love this sneaker personally. But for now, I really do not like these. Um, in the comments, make sure to leave your opinion on these. I don't know if you've seen these in person yet. I didn't like these in the pictures. I do not like these in person either. Um... Low key, it'd be interesting to see these gray laces on here, but honestly, these are a drop for me. I, I, I'd probably give these like a six out of 10 personally. Now to cap it off, I am new to YouTube. I do not know what you guys want to see on here. I'd appreciate comments, letting me know what you do want to see, sneaker reviews, anything like that. Just anything sneakers I want to make videos on. So again, leave comments on what you want to see. And for, for those, those just joining, welcome to the kingdom.